Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, we are soon coming towards the end of Lent season of fasting, praying, and almsgiving. But this does not mean that we should stop praying and giving. During Lent, one way of preparing ourselves spiritually is by listening to the stories about Jesus and His ministries. What a wonderful passage about tolerance and the power of not judging or condemning. This passage shows the power of understanding and gentle guidance in the right direction. We see Jesus' mercy in the stars at night and in the day we don't see the stars because Jesus' mercy is when the sun rises in the morning with a great light of love and tenderness. In our gospel today, the scribes and the Pharisees brought a woman who was caught in adultery. And in the law, Moses condemned to stone the woman. Jesus bent down and wrote with his fingers on the ground and then stood up and said, Let him who is without sin amongst you be the first to throw a stone at her. Then he bent down again, and one by one, they all went away. Jesus stood up and said, Woman, where are they? Has no one condemned you? The woman said, No one, Lord. And Jesus said, Neither do I condemn you. Go, and from now on, sin no more. Jesus did not humiliate the woman by asking her, why did you do it, or where, and when, or how. He just said, go and sin no more. One way to understand God's mercy is to allow ourselves to be forgiving and show mercy. A help to show mercy is to see the mercy in God's eyes, when we have a big difference with others. Compassion should always come first when we hear of others' wrongdoing. We do not know their lives, their problems, or what's in their heart. So let us not judge them. Let us be like the Lord who said, Neither do I condemn you. Go and sin no more. May God bless you during this sacred time of Lent.